Hello, yes, this is John A. Dawson with b, b Innovations. One of our first innovations is the Hook and Grow. It's a plant stabilizer. It's just a little cap, 100% made in USA, 100% recycled material made right here. Uh, basically, what we're doing is we're going to have uh, unlimited uses. We're going to stabilize this humongous tomato plant with this single cap, which would take the place of probably 20 to 20 different stakes. So that's uh, time, money, and space. So what you do is you just take this cap, put it on top of any stake in the middle of your gardening, whatever you want to do. I'd like to take some twisty tie stuff like this. It's a little bit stiff, comes with a little cutter, about two bucks. So anyway, you take this stuff, you have your stake above your projected highest point of growth. So that way you have downward radius coverage. So basically I can put this line on here and I can cover any amount of, I can go all the way to the ground, I can cover anything, go from here to there, there to here. So you just take a little projection, cut it off. What I like to do is take my finger and just wrap it around three, four times, you got a hoop. Take it, come over here to the top of your cap, grab your limb, whichever one you want. Basically, you want to go for your highest point bearing. So you come over here and you say, okay, I want this one to be first. Take this, wrap it around your limb, very so gently, kink it, so that way it's not pinching your limb. Come down here, you can continue wrapping. So you want to go with another limb, that takes the place of two stakes. All right, that limb stabilized. Come over here, you've got to read your plant. What side needs to come up first? Which one's more important? Which one's going to take the most room? This one's on the inside of that. So I want to pull this limb over with this limb because it's small and i got to worry about that big limb down there. So I'm going to say that that's what I got. Cut it at a length, put it around your finger, wrap it around four or five times where it's not going to go. You can use any material you want, big, small, heavy, light. If you have very heavy bearing limbs, you don't want to wrap too tight. Or you want to use a wider material that has like the rubber stuff with the big stop. So now you see how I pulled that limb over here to get it out of the way of the big one. You can wrap it twice, three times, four times. There's no limit to the end. You can zigzag crisscross, run four sides down, wrap it. Whatever you want to do, it's up to the uh, gardener's imagination. This limb's a big one, so we're going to pop down here and give it a little bit longer. Grab it, wrap it, put it around your finger, wingo, wingo. Come over here, throw it on top. Now you need to read your plan. Be very careful because you could break everything here. So you want to go with your tallest bearing plant here. And say, okay, I want this all the way up here because this is the big boy. This is the bad boy. What's the tallest? Well, we're going to come over here. So what we're going to do, we're going to come over here and hold this bad boy up right at this knuckle right here. Kind of big, so we'll go around it twice. Make sure you kink it so it's not pinching it. Grab your next limb, put it up in its projected height. Where it's going to need stabilization. Give it twice. This one don't need it yet. I'm going to come over here, pop on the other side really quick. This one like to, needs to be that long. Make a couple wraps, put it over top of the cap. Lift your plant up to where you want it to be at its highest point of uh, possible lighting. Your luminance are up here. This is where you want You don't want stuff out here. But you want it spaced where there's no bacteria. There's nothing wasted. The closer you get to the light, the more product you're going to have. So, come back over here, grab your next limb, put it at its projected height of harvestation, put it around two, three times if you want. Okay, we got some extra ones here, so now you can either you can add down the line, you can hoop it, you can wrap it to itself, you can put it right here and zoom it across, it's whatever you want to do. Put another one on, we got a little gap over here, so we want to fill this gap up. So we're using all our light. Okay, so come around your plant, see what's wrong, see what we need to do here. Got a little low one over here. Come around, just keep wrapping and adding. All you're doing, 
is increasing your yield 100% naturally. No additives, no nothing. 100% made in USA, 100% recycled material. Okay, so now you see this limb's over, it's starting to shoot over here and be in your way. So you come over here and use its own weight against itself. Just make a little hook, don't even have to make it go around it. Fill that area in. So now you can start to see what's happening here. You're projecting all your light. If you got any low bearing limbs, okay, this one right here. What do we do about that? Grab another one. Click it. Go around, go around, go around, put it on top. Lift this bad boy up here. Pop it around. See where it does. See where it goes. If it falls in, perfect. So now you see what you've done. You still have natural movement. You can move the plant, nothing's breaking. You can hit it, push it, push it in, whatever. Now what ends up happening is, is that you uh, start running out of room. You got more limbs, your garden's bigger. Put another cap on top, continue. Has unlimited uses. When it comes time to harvest, grab your cap, lift, cut, walk away with your whole entire plant. No need for all these stakes. If you look at how many times we went around, that's at least 15 to 20 stakes. All those eye gougers, all these things in the way. How are you supposed to move stuff? But you still have your natural movement. 100% made in USA. 100% recycled material uh, from B&B Innovations and Hook and Grow. Uh, go to our website, hookandgrow.com. Uh, they'll be in every store pretty soon. Thank you for your time.